If you are out there swallowing these oral peptides peddled by some ripped up insta guru, you are not biohacking, you're getting played. Here's what happens when biology actually gets a hold of it. It hits your stomach where the pH drops to about 1.5, unravels the peptides really critical 3D structure in about a second or two. Are you getting played by taking oral peptides? Must you inject them to receive any benefits? Well, not all peptides are equally as fragile, so we absolutely can absorb some Cassian peptides from milk, for example, but I think he's referring specifically to something like BPC-157, which is commonly sold in oral capsule form. So someone made a good comment. If you were strictly looking for gut repair, I researched the oral version of BPC-157 is best. Absolutely not. Zero functional effect, ripped to shreds in the gut. Really? Even though BPC-157 is derived from a protein in gastric juice, it can't survive in the gut? Well, the research would say otherwise. So this study found it to be stable in the gut for over 24 hours, thus giving it good oral bioavailability. In fact, in rodents, oral BPC-157 has been shown to expedite the ligament healing process. So to be fair, yes, injections may have the best bioavailability, but if, if someone is averse to needles for whatever reason, they should not necessarily totally discount some oral peptides.